Hello YouTubers, today I'm going to be doing a speed test comparison between the uh, iPhone 11, which is this one here, and the iPhone 12. Here is an iPhone 12. They are both, each, they are both 128 gigabyte in memory size. And um, I did notice, the other day I noticed that uh, we did a speed test and um, it was not as fast as, as uh, in this particular case we have T-Mobile, as T-Mobile uh, advertises the 5G speed. The one on the right is supposed to be 5G, the one on the left is still 4G. So this is the iPhone 11 and this is the iPhone 12. So I'm going to perform the uh, speed test. I'm going to disable Wi-Fi on both devices before I start the speed test. And I'm going to start the speed test now. Three, two, one. The one on the right is doing in the 60 megabits per second and it's supposed to be running on 5G. The one on the left, the iPhone 11 is still on 4G. Significantly, significantly you can see that the, the iPhone 12 is, has faster speeds but uh, nothing close to the advertised 5G speeds that we should be seeing like in the likes of one gigabit or something like that so this caught our attention the other day because um, uh, 5g as far as we know is supposed to be it's supposed to have a range of speed um, you know ability of in the hundreds of megabits or even reaching one gigabit but uh, not in this particular case so it is very strange i'm gonna do the speed test again one more time so that you guys can see and you make your own you know you you make your own judgment again the the one on the right is the iphone 12 which is 5g the one on the left is the iphone 11 still running on 4g and i'm gonna do the speed test in four three two one And the speed is a little bit faster on the iPhone 12. I mean, it's still in the 60s, almost 70 and megabits down as compared to the iPhone 11 on the left. A little bit slower. But uh, definitely not what uh, the major US carriers are advertising out there of uh, you know one megabit speed one gigabit speed and all that and all this uh, synchronous abilities of uh, new technology um, remote um, uh, remote car driving and and all these other things that supposedly people are going to be able to do over 5g it may be because um, here in miami 5g was recently uh, launched by T-Mobile, but uh, you can notice that those speeds are not, uh, it's not what, what is advertised out there. So you make your, you make your own judgment. On the second run I did, I got on the iPhone 12, 60 megabits down and 48 upload. And on the iPhone 11, 20 megabits down and 6. 14 megabits up and as a matter of fact uh, before on my iPhone 11 I used to get faster speed so I'm I mean I'm beginning to wonder like uh, what is going on could it be the weather could it be the uh, the antennas are acting out whatever it could be so but uh, again you know uh, the purpose of, the purpose of the video is to 
to do a comparison between the speed test of both phones. Thank you, YouTubers, and if, if you do like the content that I'm, um, I am uh, releasing out there, hit a like, and I would appreciate if you subscribe as well. Thank you again, guys.